This picture has taken Lubbock by storm. I really didn't know what to think. Uh, I've never heard of the organization. Um, didn't really seem to really care to look, up, look it up or anything, but it, yeah, it really did wow me. I didn't know. It's different. Um, I haven't seen anything like that before, so I just, I just need to, I guess, go online and see what it's about. If you take the billboard's advice and head over to the website, you are greeted by this video. He was beaten and bloodied and killed for us and took the markings that should have been ours upon himself. People find out that they have scars and they have things in their past that, um, that they haven't let go of. And, and what's kind of cool is that Christ says he'll take that from us. And, and so, so through tattoos and that kind of way, we use that imagery to show that. The idea came about as a unique way to reach people that aren't involved in church. And Jay says the sign's controversial image is natural. There's controversy when our, when our, when our Lord and Savior was on this earth and when the things that he said and the things that he did. And I know that some people see this as even a little bit of controversy, but what's really cool about it is that it's really a love story. And as you get involved in it and as you look at it and watch the video, I believe that it draws you into that story. And Jay hopes this is only the beginning. We're hoping that by the, you know, by the end of the 30-day campaign that we see it just kind of blow up all over the world. That would be awesome.